What's up guys, my name is Josh and today I'm going to be showing you how to downgrade your WordPress site. You may need to do this if um, you have your theme no longer supports like updated versions of WordPress. In my case it was due to I bought a theme online from Theme Forest and the developer stopped make, uh, developing the theme so it, when it came to the newer versions of WordPress it just completely cocked up and everything didn't work, loads of sliders didn't work, they were going all over the place, the CSS was ruined there were many there were many factors that that played into this it just it did, so I had to eventually I had to downgrade my WordPress site to the working version of uh, for the theme which which helped a lot so I, I'm, in this tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to do that I'm going to show you how to downgrade to any specific version of WordPress you want um, but in this case we're going to be downgrading from 4.5 down to 4.2 I believe so on my right hand side as you can see I've got my WordPress directory which is WordPress underscore 2 which is this site here as you can see I'm at WordPress underscore 2 and this is WordPress 4.2 this is I've downloaded this from the archive and um, I will put a link into the, the description for the WordPress archives below so this is 4.2 um, it's all we're gonna do is fit well actually the first thing we need to do is the first thing we need to do is we need to disable all the plugins that we have so let's go to our the back end and let's go to our plugins directory and I'm gonna turn off all of these because it only it it's not helpful next we need to obviously log out of WordPress let's log out so we don't need to be in it anymore and what we're doing is that we're going to go into our WordPress directory and we're going to delete the admin, the includes, and everything else. So then left is purely just the content. It's just the content. So we're going to just delete that now. So let's move that to trash. Oh. And then we're going to copy everything from 4.2 except the WP contents. We're going to drag that into our new into our WordPress underscore two directory. Okay, so let's refresh, create a new config file because we've actually we've overridden our config file, which was actually quite stupid. So hang on, let me just go into my trash and pick up the config file. Let's, let's replace this because we actually need that config file. Didn't think. <laughs> so let's refresh again. And now we have a WordPress site again. So nothing nothing seems to have changed. But if we log in, we'll log in. Oh. Database update required. This is because we actually downgraded to a version of WordPress. So that's fine. So let's update the WordPress database. That was successful. Continue. And let's log in. Oh. oh, hang on, I just realised it's not that one. It is this. There we go. So as you can see, we're not on version 4.5, we're actually on version, it actually says we're on version 4.5. No, it doesn't, no, it doesn't. That says get version 4.5. If we actually have a look and we can go to, I believe, our settings menu, we can have a look general and see what version we are running. Hmm, I'm not quite sure where we, where do we go to pick that up? Why didn't it tell us? It should tell us that we're on 4.5. Oh, there we go. WordPress 4.2. Exactly. So it's worked. So it successfully worked. Um, but obviously before you delete your entire directory, it would be advised to uh, do a backup of your WordPress site. I use all-in-one WP migration, which is a great plugin, works 100% for me. I'll leave a link in the description for that. Just do a, a backup of your WordPress site before you begin your downgrade, because the last thing you want to do is obviously you've you've just decided to just delete it all immediately without any backup and you've downgraded it to a version and that it for some reason might not work or your plugins might be too old or your theme you've gone back too far all right so just be careful when you're doing it okay so thank you very much for watching guys I hope you like this video let me know in the comments what you think um, if it's a bad video let me know in the comments as well so I can improve 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Speak to you soon. Bye.